and the community's really keen on seeing what evidence is uncovered. Cheslada Carrier Nation announced a partnership with Rio Tinto on an archaeological project that will see the aluminum producer contribute $2.8 million for surveying and excavating a variety of sites of cultural and historical significance. We actually pinpointed several of the old village sites. So we went back down there and concentrated last year on a substantial field reconnaissance and we mapped out all of these sites that are proven to be some of the most substantial village sites ever discovered in British Columbia. The project will have archaeologists collecting, preserving, and studying artifacts found around Tadachek Lake on the south side of the Nechako Reservoir, some of which possibly span the past 10,000 years or more. The Tadachek site is located in one of the primary migration routes of how humans came into North America. So the evidence that, that we're uncovering now and will uncover over the next few years is going to add to the to the scientific record and the anthropological record of how humans actually came into the Americas. Robertson says Cheslada is eager to work with the multi-million dollar corporation despite the two sides' differences in the past. The logistics of the Tedachuk site is very, very challenging. It's, it's a five-hour drive from right where I'm sitting in the area. So we're very excited to be working with Rio Tinto. For CFDK-TV News, I'm Eddie Huband in Burns Lake.